Hi guys, um, it's Willing Away, and welcome back to some more Alan Wake. We're officially on episode 5, which means we just have one more after this. I do have all my things written down here again, so we are going to try for 100%. So this might be a long one. I don't know, how, this one looks actually like a short one, in all honesty. Uh, I'm excited. Alright, <laughs> before I keep rambling on, uh, we might as well just get started. Alrighty. Continue game. Alright, I was just making sure of something. <laughs> I know last time, what is it? I was, it, this was a stream a while back. Manuscript pages were gone. Oh, hi, the Alan. The FBI agent had taken them. Yep. I think, I think my tongue just took a crap in my mouth. <laughs> uh, but no, last Wait, time I was streaming and I put a game up, it for some reason had its own audio. <laughs> so it was like good. double audio. That I was just making sure that up. wasn't happening again. Oh. Uh, I am never Is drinking coming? again. Dude, Barry, you good? I need to talk to Weaver. She's the one in the song. The Lady of the Light. What, the crazy lady? Ugh, whatever you say, Al, but we're stuck here. They're not gonna... I had some reading to do first, Sheriff. And let me tell oh, you... Oh, hi, guys. It was an interesting <laughs> read. Well... I've got you now, Raymond Chandler. It's all here. All the evidence, including conspiracy to murder a federal agent. There's no way you're walking out of here. You hear me in there, Brett Easton Ellis? Huh? What? Agent Nightingale, I want to talk to your superior. Who? Well, we all want things, Sheriff. I wanted my... <sighs> Look, that's not possible right now. Agent Nightingale, I insist. Oh, no. <sighs> oh, no, <Yeah>. Ellen! <laughs> Holy shit. Wake, what's wrong? Lady, are you stupid? It's a trick. It's an obvious trick. Okay, I've had enough of this crap. Wake, I'm gonna trust you with this. You're joking. Agent Nightingale, your opinion would matter more if you were sober <gasps> and if I actually believed you were here on official business. Oh, get his ass. Ooh. Whoa. Get, get back in the cell, Stephen King. The only way you're leaving this place is over my dead... Wait a minute. I know this... <laughs> What the fuck? Oh my god! Light. We need light. It's the only way to fight this thing. In my office. I've got your things there. Follow me. Oh, oh. oh man. Follow Sarah. Oh the my lights gosh. Out. Okay, so here's the first two. All right, here we go. Is there any other papers? No. All right, then yeah, those are the first two manuscripts. That was actually really quick. Hold on. All right. All right, let's continue to look for these. Uh, anything in here? Oh, is that a flare? Ooh, hell yeah, give me that. Okay. Oh, and another flare. So we got the flare. I'm excited. I don't know, I've never gotten this far in this game, so I really have no clue what's gonna happen next. So we got that thermos. All right, hold on. Let me just make sure. We can't go anywhere else. Let me mark off that thermos. Thir is it thermos or thermos? I don't know. I never really cared to check. Ooh. Lights are back. Alright, Sarah. I completely forgot your name was Sarah. I'm gonna be honest. Oh my things. god. What do I need to know? What do you need from me? It was they can be hurt hell. in the light. Only in the light. And I need to find Cynthia Weaver. She can help me stop this. Light. Check. Cynthia. She lives in the old decommissioned power plant. Why? I'll be there pretty quickly in the rescue chopper. Come on. Let's get back to your friend. Uh, okay. I'm gonna guess there's nothing else Wheeler, here. I need you to stay here. What? No. We're going to fetch our ride, but I have friends who need to be warned about this, and I can't be in two places at once. I need your help. Well, okay. Here's a list of people and phone numbers. I need you to call them and tell them you have a message from me. Night Springs, okay? They'll know what to do. Night Springs? Like the TV show? Gotcha. Oh, hey, that radio guy is on the list, Maine. Who's Frank Breaker? He related to you? My dad. Hey, is this like a secret society? <laughs> Can you do this? You'll be safe here. Whoa, what the hell? 
just in case we don't come back. Oh my uh, god. You'll come back for me though, right? As soon as we get the chopper ready. Thanks, Wheeler. I owe you one. Okay, let's go, Wake. Through the back. Damn, she honestly at first I thought she was annoying, but she's pretty damn good. Alright, let's go, Sarah. Do I call you Sarah? Beaker? Who do I call you? I'll go. I'll open the gate for you once I'm across. You stay here in the light and cover me, Sheriff, oh. okay? There we go. Are Checkpoint sure? reached. Okay, then. But hurry. Okay. Where am I going? Find a way to access the rooftops. Damn. Okay. Uh, not through there. Not through there. <laughs> um, am I supposed to know how to do this? I bet you they said it and I just... Oh, ladder. There we go. Alright, let's remember we can jump. Focus. I needed to reach the rooftop to get to the other side of the broken gate. Oh no, I already see the crows. Ugh, I'm not a crow fan. At least not in this game. Crows are not your friend in this game. Whoa, hi. Ow. Oh, hi. You just sitting down there? I mean, I ain't one to judge, but okay. Oh, <gasps> big deer! 68th annual deer fest. What? Oh, God. Hi, crows. Oh, in light, you can hurt them. I see a flare already. I do want to check some stuff out. Let's not fall off the roof, please. That would be a pretty bad way to go. Uh, any, any other ones I need to injure? I don't think. Yeah, I think we're good. If I just climb up here. Yep, just don't step on that thing. Hop. Oh, Ooh, I almost landed on that one. Oh no. Oh, birds, birds! Come on. Oh, so close. Oh god, there's more birds. Ooh. Ow! Oh. Okay. Ow. This is fun. Going to assume it stopped. <laughs> right, well, hey, Sheriff. Let me just head on password. down. Night Springs? What's that all about? Stupid joke we have. That Bright Falls is the original inspiration for the TV show. This I mean, can get weird at she's not wrong. Never this weird, though. <laughs> Alright. Ah. To bypass the damaged control box. What am I, an electrician? Hold on. Yeah, hold on. I'm I'm breaking things. Wait, how do? <laughs> Can I access it? Okay. Oh, ah, man, that's smart. Good job, Wade. Smart. Stick close. Our first stop is the town hall. The keys to the chopper are there. Oh no. Oh no. <gasps> oh! oh my god, it's it's gonna start flying, isn't it? Okay, there we go. Oh god. Oh my god. Ah! <laughs> Probably switch to my oh revolver. So is everybody in Bright Falls now taking over? That's not good. Alright, I just need to see if there's anything this way. I'm gonna guess no, there's just a flare here. Flare, and it's getting very smoky. 
usually means enemies. Yay. Alright, I know there's like a lot of stuff to do here. So, this is our first, this is our first T intersection, isn't it? Oh. The deer? What? Careful because I know that truck's behind us too. Ah. Sh move. Ooh, Sarah! Girl, I need you on my team. Good lord. Alright, so I believe we go this way, right? I know, I know, I hear ya, but uh I got I got stuff to check out and make sure it's all good. Maybe I'm in the wrong location? Actually, can I walk up here? <gasps> I am not! Hello, chest! Alright, pick up flare gun and flare gun ammo. And I'm actually gonna pause that before we summon a ton of stuff. So yeah, that was our first chest. Good night. Alright. trying to see okay hold on I actually have to make sure we're at the right one what place is this because depending on what this is I might have actually gotten a different one Oh no, here we go. Okay, we're in the right direction. Yeah, so there's an arrow pointing that way, but we've already gotten that one. <gasps> Thermos! Ooh, you being sneaky! I see ya! Alright. Oh, I almost missed that one. Oh god. Alright. Being a little sneaky, I see. Trying to hide about. Alright, there's like, definitely going to be another one here. I just need to find where it is. I think it's like over here somewhere. Well, that is straight into water. Oh, here we go. The air smelled of fish. This was Bright Falls Industrial Area. There was probably a cannery nearby. Yes, so we have to go by the cannery. Oh! Oh god. Gotta get that guy back over there. But this guy in this yellow jacket is in the way. There we go. So we are definitely all alone here. I do not see Sarah. But there's definitely a chest around here somewhere. Alright. Anything over here? Nope. I mean, I have to check, you know? Just gotta... Just gotta make sure. Oh, another flare gun. Alright, let me mark this one down. Well, there's our second chest. Seems like there's gonna be a lot of chests here. A lot of chests, a lot of uh, thermos, actually, from what I remember writing down. But, you know what? We got this. Just gotta pay attention and try not to rush through areas, now that I'm thinking about it, because we almost missed that thermos there, which would have been completely my fault. <laughs> uh, so we just gotta, just gotta play this carefully. 
Bright Diner. Hello. Keeping my eyes peeled for something. Anything. Actually, we do have to enter here. We do have to enter Bright's Diner. If we can. Yes. Okay. So. Ooh, batteries. I'll, I would play it if I didn't know what song was going to play. Ooh, a heavy duty flashlight. I'm gonna want explanations, you know. For example, what the hell happened to Rose? She's seriously messed up now. The same thing I think happened to me after I arrived. During this week you can't remember? Oh, I remember now. <laughs> oh. Oh, I remember now. Hi, manuscript. Alright. Okay. Just making sure. I want to get out of this dark hallway. So we got the thermos in here, I believe. So we got that thermos... And we got the manuscript in here. Alright. Let's make sure we did get that thermos. Yeah. Alright. You can go now. Sarah, sorry for holding you up. Anything in here? Eek. Imagine if I got myself stuck. <laughs> I would cry, dude. I would be like, just my luck, you know? Just my luck, I get myself stuck. Alright, follow. There's another one? Don't tell me there's another chest here. Oh, good here lord. Go. Ah! Kill him. Did not mean to use that gun. I always forget I have a flare gun equipped until I shoot it. It's like, god damn it, dude. Okay. Oh, that's a lot of porta potties. Ah! Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ow, ow, ow. Sarah, it is good to have you. Oh my god. Oh, dude, I love having Sarah. <laughs> you are a good friend to keep around. Alright. Oh, yes. Please give me that checkpoint light. I love it. Means I don't lose anything that I was just messing around with. Alright, nothing in here. Gotta keep my eyes open because we are looking for something. Oh no. Well, here's the, the can pyramid. Okay, hold on. <laughs> hold on, why am I such a bad aim at this? There we go. Uh, I'm gonna pause before that goes crazy. But there was our first can pyramid. All right. All right. Oh, ow, I just stabbed my finger on my pen. That felt nice. Oh. Wait, over here! There's light! Okay, hold on. Girl, what light are you talking about? Alright. I believe this is where I have to, sadly, disengage from Sarah. And head over here, yep. Alright. Let's grab some ammo. Uh, and... Apparently we can't- we've reached our limit for that. And grab the thermos. Uh, Alright, sorry, I know there's gonna be a lot of me stopping and starting, but it is worth it so that I do not accidentally get killed while just sitting here. Oh, wait. Is there something in here too? No, it's just a yellow moving van. 
I have a key. Watch my back. Wait. Oh god, I gotta watch your back. Oh fuck. It's an ambush. Shoot. Shoot. Oh my god. She just killed my ass. Let's be careful. Sarah, I'm gonna say this as nicely as possible. Why would you shoot him as I'm trying to get away from him? Yep, yep, I hear ya. I'm gonna go actually grab what I need to go grab. It's because she, she's using that, uh, that shotgun. So it's causing them to, like, move, uh, what is it, move closer to me when she shoots them. Alright, so, uh, can we, actually, can we actually activate anything over here? Okay. I have a key. Watch my back, yep, wait. I'm watching your back. I'm actually gonna use this gun. It's an ambush. Could use that flare gun on him. I might actually. Ready? Great. No. Sarah. Hey, girl. Hey, girl. Hey. Last I checked, I need your help. <laughs> and I was, I was just talking her praise, too. Oh god, okay, okay, okay. Oh! There we go. Oh, he's still alive. There we go. Not anymore. reload this gun grab some more ammo and disappear please open the gate <laughs> let's go wake okay uh, so it's this way yes there's that thermos okay so we got the, that thermos uh, reserve for town employees oh some flares Yes, please. We can use all the flares we need. All right. So we got that thermos by the picnic tent. And now I believe we should be entering the town hall. All right. Okay, someone's messed with the fuse box here, but you should be able to jury rig it while I find the keys. I already got electrocuted once today. How about I look for the keys and you get burned for a change? Fine. They should be in the <laughs> clerk's office on the other side of the building near the main entrance. Dude was like, I've already been injured. It's your it's your turn tonight. I ain't doing it. Alright, so we got that manuscript. Phone? The message was from Barry. He was getting worried at the station. He wanted us to hurry. Okay. Uh God, I- where's the door? Okay. Okay. <laughs> that was fun. That was fun. Gosh, my heart rate went up, dude. Alright. Uh, you gotta find those keys. Gonna guess they're. Ooh, switch to lantern. Hell yeah. Ooh, some flashbangs. And there are the keys, but I actually want to come back here at a different date. Uh, let's see what was in here. Ooh, 
hunting rifle. Yes, please. Alright, so we got that hunting rifle. Hunting ammo. <gasps> Thermos. Another one. Or, well, actually, I believe we got the manuscript first. So, yep, we got the manuscript. We got that thermos. Uh, let's see. Alright, and then we just have to go upstairs and we have two more things to get. I'm just gonna take a quick look. Girl, how would you know the keys aren't upstairs, though? How would you know? Alright. What are we looking for? Oh. Well, we found it. A chest, I'm guessing? Oh, oh my god. done. Please give me my chest. <laughs> Alright, let's reload that weapon. I can mark off this chest. And we are roughly halfway done with chests. We just have one more thing here. I just need to find it. What does that say? Oh my god, the darkness controls the Taken. Really? Does it? Oh, this is what I was looking for. This light is so bright. <laughs> I, I don't know why. Alright. It's our first TV. In Night Springs. Tonight's episode. Taken in his prime. <laughs> what is a name like that? Huh? Like someone being well, hunted? Well, look what I found. Ah, please don't! <laughs> yeah, I think you're just about ready for it. Best if you don't resist this kid. You gotta beat it out of you. What? What? I don't understand. What, what did I do? I just wanted to get a job in the service industry. <laughs> Pal, you're gonna serve all right. Springs. That's totally not at all uh, concerning. I don't know. <laughs> Do you guys think that's concerning? Nah. <laughs> Definitely not at all. A little worrying. Alright. Let us... Oh! Hi! There you are. Um, let me get the keys real quick. Thank you. Okay, Sheriff. I got the keys. That's. I have everything though, right? Yes. Alright. Oh, I do not have everything. It's in here. Nothing I can get anyways. Alright. Oh shit. Cutscene. I wasn't expecting that. Barry? Why isn't he inside? Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> oh my god, the car's flying behind him. Run, Barry, run! Barry! Look out! Barry, move! Oh shit. Ooh, my god. Barry! He made it inside, Wake. He's okay. 
<laughs> oh my god. The storefront's blocked. Come on, Wake. Let's go around. We can meet him in the back. Hold on, I gotta, I gotta look. I gotta make sure where we're going is where, where I need us to go. Can I hop over? Oh, nope. Nope, that answered my question. Oh my god. I was gonna see if we could hop over the fence, but uh, no. No, you, you can't. Alright. Is this... Huh, wait a minute. Okay, hold on, this is our first sign. It's not recorded when Bright Falls was first formed as a nameless trading post, but it became a town when the Bright Falls Mining Company started to operate nearby in 1878. It was then that Hubert Bilt Biltmore, a fur trapper, and Amos Gunderson, a pioneer from Tacoma, decided to build a post office, saloon, and hotel, all operating from the same building. It was through the efforts of these two men at the Bright Fall that Bright Falls became the permanent and thriving town it is today. All right. That is our first sign tonight. Just gotta make sure there's nothing else hidden about. I don't think so. But you never know. Oh my god. Nope. I used a flare gun. Kill four taken with a single shot from the flare gun. Come one, come all. Holy shit. I uh, did not mean to do that, but I did. Damn. I'm just that good, guys. <laughs> I'm joking. We can make it through the bookstore. Wheeler should be waiting for us in the backyard. Get the hell down or I'll call the sheriff. Oh, hi, Doc. I've got it. Don't worry about it. Sarah, about time somebody showed up. All the shooting in the air is idiotic. One of these days, they'll kill somebody. And over deer fest. <laughs> Go back to bed. Okay. Alright. Yeah, I think we just have to enter the bookstore. I don't think there's anything else here that we can get. Alright, well, hello, Thermos. I see you staring at me. Thank you. Alrighty. Let's continue looking. This is our next sign. Alex Casey books by Alan Wake, modern master of crime fiction, Alex Casey, what I can't forget, return to sender, the things that I want, the fall of Casey, and the sudden stop. All in stock. $20 a book, $100 for the full set. Mr. Wake is in town, see if he can get them autographed. You know, Alex Casey, you know what that name reminds me of? It's another author. They're really taking advantage of your presence here, Wake. I heard they're selling a lot of your Alex Casey books. It sounds like Alex right Cross. Now, I'm not a big Robert. fan of my own writing. Is it Pat Patterson? Well, I know it's Patterson. I can't remember if his first name is Patterson or not. Or Robert. But, uh, the Alex Cross series by Patterson. It, uh, it reminds me of that. Alright, so we got that manuscript. Cool. Can I actually go upstairs or is it blocked? Oh no. We can go upstairs. Is there anything up here worth exploring? Some books. I'm guessing nothing. I just, I don't know. Usually if you can go upstairs somewhere, there's a reason for it, but I'm gonna push it. Alright, so we're gonna exit. I don't see Barry. Whoa! Way to the chopper. Okay, we'll head that way. I do want to check something out first, though. Okay. Ah, is it in here? Yep. Hello, chest. There are so many chests. Alright, so we got that chest. Make sure there's nothing else in here. Oh, nope, I, oh, nope, that is just the corner of the wheelbarrow. Can they stop breathing in my ear, please? Alright. Hello, Thermos. Mind if I grab you? Thank you. Alright, 
There should be nothing else here. Alright. I hated that sound. That's something from like a horror movie. Like the creaking of gates. Ugh. Worst sound. Alright. So. Where do they want us to go? Alright, what's this one? Flashbang. Just another lantern. Hunting rifle. Oh, we just picked up another lantern? Alright. Hey, this is the person who's been placing the, uh, the boxes. Huh. Or at least the person who's been placing the boxes gets them from these boxes. Interesting. Alright, sale. I believe there should be something in here, right? Haha! -ha. Manuscript, yes. Alright, so we got that manuscript. Uh, everything else. Oh, we have another sign. And that's, I think that's about it over here. I don't think I see anything else. Yeah, no. So we just gotta go read that sign and then we're good. Hello, sign. Church events, fall schedule. Sunday schools, Sundays. Bible study, Mondays. Bright Falls knitting club meetings. Alt, uh, alt Wednesday evenings. Deer fest, candle night. September 14th, Deerfest Morning Service, September 15th, the Presbyterian Choir of Watery Visit, September 18th, or September 28th, and Annual Charity Bake Sale, October 3rd. Interesting. Alright. In. Into the area. Concealed firearms are prohibited in this facility. I'm gonna <laughs> give Pastor Howard a piece of my mind about this lock. Ugh, I told him to get it fixed. Uh oh. Oh no. Survive the assault? Are you kidding me? There we go. Is that enough? Don't tell me there's more. Nope, yep, there's definitely more. Ugh. Why? Why do you guys just say the weirdest things? Oh no. Oh my god! Oh my god. Uh, why are they so fast? Oh, this has got to be the most annoying, it's just when they're super fast. Alright, let's reload our gun. Okay. Are we done? Please tell me we're done. I don't want to do that again. Alright. Can you open the door? Or is the lock still weird? Okay, it's open. Okay. Let's go, Wake. Alright, great. So. Focus. Wow. We keep them lit all night long on the night before Deer Fest. Why? Well, it's tradition. This is actually really pretty. Churches are always so pretty, though. Alright, manuscript. Alright, we got that one. Anything else? No? Just one more thing, but that's the only thing in the church. Alright, I'm ready. We're almost there. We'll have to go through the basement to get to the parking lot. Yeah. Oh. There's no way going through the crypt will turn out to be a bad idea. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I was thinking. I was like, oh great. The basement. Or actually, yeah, this is this really is a, a crypt. Oh good lord. Okay. It's totally not concerning. Oh, I see a thermos. Where? Okay, we 
got him. Uh, thank God. Okay. Let's get this thermos. Let me mark it off real quick. All right. Excuse me, ma'am. Just gotta make sure everything is clear here. Oh, that's just a, that's a furnace. Don't know why I thought that was like three flares each individually propped up. All right, kick it. Tough audience. <laughs> well, I got plenty more. What what are the Christmas lights for? Protection, man. Like garlic against vampires. Oh, it's so good to see Barry. Vampires. Can we enter through here? The the no. Come on. Okay, well, hold on. I was told there was something here. I'm making sure we're getting it. Hold on. Oh, I, I need to read better. <laughs> I need to read better. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> oh, missing. I wonder if that's one of like, the developer's cats. I, I know, like, what is it? Uh, we were playing The Wolf Among Us, like, in stream, up, like, a day ago. And the cat for one of the missing photos is named Pixel. And apparently, that's one of the, uh, that's one of the developer's cat. <laughs> oh, I love that for you, Barry. Hey, yeah. I want a headlamp. Last one. Bastard. <laughs> I want a headlamp. Last one. I'm just gonna say this. We have four more manuscripts for this episode. Make make that make sense. I don't know how we're down to only four, but apparently we are. I'm not complaining, I'm just shocked. There's something over there. I think my eyesight's gone, but thank you. Right, I don't know where we are or where we're supposed to be headed. I'm just gonna keep heading up this way. No! Fuck, why? What is. Come on, kill him. Oh shit, that's too close to us. Yeah, that won't hurt them. There we go. You're still not dead? You are still not dead. Barry. Barry is like my favorite character when I'm playing Alan Wake. Like, oh my god. The helicopter's just right. up ahead. I'll need a while to prep for takeoff. Okay. Don't take too long. I want to get out of here. I need to make sure I have everything actually. Anything over here? Oh, hi Thermos. Thermos. I don't know, something. So we got that. Let me grab everything real quick. Or at least everything nearby. Stock up on the essentials. Anything here? Some more batteries. A lot of shotgun ammo and flashbangs. Oh god, this is gonna be like a final stand, ain't it? 
Yeah. I'm gonna take a shotgun, actually. Pick up three flares. Guess we can't enter here. Yeah, no. Alright. I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn these on, actually. <laughs> no! Um, please tell me you have Alan in there. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh god, oh god. Ah, uh, drop him, drop him. Don't die, please don't die. <gasps> what the fuck? So the safety is on? dropping one over there. Oh god. Oh god. Oh my god. Oh, this is like shaking the camera so badly. Oh god, don't turn off. Please tell me you got that thing going. Stay back. Ow. Stop throwing axes at me. That hurts. I'm in pain. Okay. How much longer I gotta... Oh my god, get me back up here. Thank God. Shit, get me in there, please. Wait, you better put an end to this. Just get me to Weaver, Sheriff. You're taking a big chance on a local crazy lady, Al. I hope you're right about her, or we can kiss this town goodbye. No, oh, no. <laughs> no. We got this. You know what? We got this. We're fine. We're okay. We just gotta get to Weaver. And then we'll be A okay. I hope you know how to deal with this, Wake. I guess you New Yorkers are used to rough situations like this. Right. <laughs> the city's a war zone. King Kong, mutant alligators. Then Alex Casey shoots the place up every weekend. Look, I never even carried a gun until a couple of days ago. Well, my dad used to be a cop there. Tells some pretty wild stories. Stuff like this? No, no, <laughs> just normal bad stuff. Kind of like your books, Wake. I used to tease dad that he was just like Alex Casey. You've read me. Oh, sure. You're a pretty good writer. A little heavy on the metaphors, maybe. <laughs> Nobody's ever said that before. 
We're coming up on the power plant. What, See nobody the said you're a good writer? Or nobody and said that you're a little heavy on the metaphors? The <laughs> I can't land here. I'll take her down the road across the river. Just get me there, Sheriff. Oh no. Oh no, oh no. Oh god, oh god. Oh shit. Well, this is fun. Okay. anything. Okay, get me in here. Okay, we got a revolver, batteries, and a ton of ammo. Oh my god. Okay, so let me mark off that thermos we got. So that was this one. Okay. So... Let's get into that warehouse real quick. Alright. Darkness controls the taken. There we go. <gasps> no! No! Alan, turn around, turn around, turn around. Should be open now. Please. Oh, thank God. Alright. So, we got some more ammo, more batteries. I always hate how when you go to a new location you lose everything though. Like, that sucks. I like keeping my stuff. Well, I see a radio. Which makes me wonder what we're what we're doing with a radio, because I actually have no radios this uh, episode. There's supposed to be no radios, so I wonder what this one says. And here's a new song from a band that they always remind me of our local rock legends. <gasps> oh God. Oh god. Oh. Oh god, I hope this music isn't copyrighted. There we go. Thank god. Yet. God, uh, this. Uh, I hate this. I'm just gonna pull out a flare, honestly. And here's a new song from a band. Ow! running at me. 
Ooh. Flare. When it comes to the big guys, I, I don't fuck around. Oh god. was a thing I could do. Ah! Shit. No, I don't have any flares left! Fuck. And here's a new song from a band that's... This fair, dude. No, oh, get back here. Okay, no. Are you kidding me? What am I supposed to do? Is this just a never ending thing? Can I not defeat them here? Okay, well, I'm just probably gonna run then. Because. There's no point in me staying and constantly trying if this this is just gonna fucking do the same shit over and over again. So. Hey, new song. Yep, hello. I'm gonna hit this. Hope you enjoy flares. I'm gonna grab revolver ammo. Got some of this stuff. Shoot that. Alright, there we go. Okay, so, uh, we got that thermos. We are more than halfway done with the thermoses. Alright. Okay. So, it doesn't look like there's anything here. There will be something here. The power part oh, that sounds fun. Light. It was close. But I had to find a way across. Right, we got this. Here we go. Yep, there's a chest over here. Hello. Alright, so that is that chest. trying to make sure I have everything. It, this is where it starts to get a little confusing. Alright, let's open this. Ah! Oh my god. 
Well, hello. I already know we can't go through there, so... Uh, I'm just gonna have to accept the fact that we can't. Uh, we can't go through there either, because of the wires. Um... Oh my god, a light! Thank you! Ugh, I love lights. Alright. More wires. <gasps> Warning! Ah! I'm dead. <sighs> this game, dude, I swear. Okay. Oh no. Oh, why can't I move? Why can't I move? Why can't I? Pfft, fuck off, dude. Sincerely. Really? Really? Oh my god. You know what? I'm done. Get over here, guys. I usually don't like wasting this, but get over here. Great, lovely moment. Thank you. Didn't want to have to do that, but apparently uh, there was no other way I could take you guys out, so... Script. Alright, so we got this manuscript. We can mark that off. Alright. Alright, I think we're we're good. We can just can't kind of keep going. say no to all this stuff. Oh, I see the thermos that I was looking for. Get over here. Oh. Okay, well, I'll be back for you. <laughs> uh, I'll be back. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'm about to worry. I'm about to worry. Okay, good. I'm just gonna try pushing you into the wires. Whew. Alright, well that was a smart move. Okay, so pick up this thermos. I'm just gonna keep calling it random names from now on. Thermos. Because I don't know uh, which exactly one I should do. Alright. Continue to explore. Oh, we can't go that way. Alright, let's use this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's really taking its time. Oh! Manuscript, hello. Oh, I see some cans here. Is there anything anything I should know about? <laughs> Alright. Boom, alright, um Well we have literally two more of these things, which is kinda shocking actually. I was expecting more. Okay, making sure we're all caught up on everything. All right, let's keep going then. Down we go. All right. I believe there's supposed to be something here. 
Uh, maybe we'll find it in the light. Well, maybe I just don't know where it is. Oh, never mind. Wrong way. Alright. Here is another sign. Lieutenant William T.G. Randall Memorial Bridge. This bridge has been designated as a memorial in honor and, and in recognition of Lieutenant William T.G. Randall, 1919-1981. to World War II uh, prisoner of war and recipient of the Distinguished Service Cross. He died of injuries received during his successful rescue of two children from a burning car crashed at this location. Damn. Alright, so that's... Uh, our third sign. Actually, our fourth, so we're more than halfway done. I couldn't get across until I found a way to turn the bridge. Alan, uh, quick question. Did I ask? Did I ask? <laughs> uh, thank you. Alright. Let us look for the last! Ooh. Sneaky. Ugh. This game really knows how to give you a heart attack. Okay. Great. Isn't there supposed to be something around here? You know what? I'm not gonna question it. Maybe I'm just in the wrong area? I have no clue. Let's see. Aha! I was in the wrong area. There we go. Oh god, I can already feel a fight arriving, so let me quickly mark this out. Oh my god, hello bridge! You are announcing your presence here. Do I have to magically hop on it? What? I thought I, I was waiting for it to stop, but is it just constantly turning? That's not scary. Ah! Oh god. Oh, I knew it. How rude this is. Shit, I should have just stayed on the other side. Ow. Shoot. Okay, here we go. No. Alan, go, Alan. Get up here, get up here, get up here and in here. Oh, thank god. Alright, well, let's get that thermos. Please and thank you. Alright. We have five more thermoses, two more manuscripts, and actually, behind us, yep, should be our last TV. I Such don't know what you mean by that. By necessity abstract. Let's sit down and watch and while I mark off my stuff. can find concrete proof of the nature of our existence in Night Springs. Mm -hmm. Tonight's episode, An Absence of Creativity. Hello, Martha. What did you want to show me? Oh, Lydia, thank God you're here. Please, it's in the basement. What is in, in the basement? What are we looking at? Oh, Martha. Oh, that's amazing. Is 
isn't it just? I found it here this morning. It's like it isn't there, but... Oh, I can't look straight at it. Yes, uh, I'm sorry about that. Oh, who, uh, uh, how did what? you get here? Well, I'm trying to work. Did you put this thing here? In a way. To be more precise, I put everything here but that. Really? But what is it? Oh, I guess the temptation is to call it a hole, but it's really <laughs> what? an absence. Their voices make me laugh. Of reality. In Martha's basement? Yes. In Martha's so basement? Well, too. I came up with two old ladies and put something really weird in the basement. It was a great start, but I'm completely blocked now. I can't imagine what I was up to. Well, surely it's just an ordinary basement. Is it? Why did you call your friend here then? Well, I, I don't know. What? Well, couldn't you just ignore it? Oh no, I couldn't do that. It would probably turn into a plot hole. Might be one already. <laughs> could sink the whole enterprise. Plot hole. Oh, my. Listen, ladies, not to be rude, but I'm really not at all sure where I'm going with this, and you're just not helping. You should just go back upstairs for a cup of coffee while I try to figure out what I'm up to. Well, if you think that's best. I gasp. Maybe I should just stop here. Or is that too moronic? Let is me guess, Alan. This was one you wrote. <laughs> it's a fine line between the stupid and the sublime. Alright. Well... I guess let's keep going. Whoa! We managed to lose the flock! You're almost at the power plant! Keep going! I'll give you support! Hold on, I'm, I'm looking around, but thank you. Alright. Is she just flying next to me right now? Shit. Are you trying to hide? Ow, ow, ow. There we go. Alright, let's reload this gun. Okay. Let's keep going then. Ooh, girl, you are going too fast with that light. Hold on. Too close for comfort. Okay. Should be three shots. Well, two now. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Let's keep going, I guess. Totally just gonna stay in the light. I need to see, uh. Can you see? Actually, hold on. We gotta go this way. Yep, chest! Always putting in hidden locations. Alright, here we go. Ooh, not bad. Not bad at all. We have one more chest. All right. Okay. I'm just making sure I'm getting everything I need. All right. Let's keep 
keep going, I guess. Oh, I hate that. Oh no. Oh no. Damn it. I'm missing something here. Let me see. Definitely missing something. Huh. Let me just go over this one last time. <laughs> Make sure I really am missing nothing. Okay. I guess there really is nothing here. We'll keep going and hopefully we didn't miss anything. broke. Damn it. Don't know how long that's been broken. Alright, hold on. Alright. We should be back. Hi, sorry about that. Uh, Alan, you good? Okay, there we go. It was just a little wonky. We had to the fix the camera. Side. I'd seen a version of it painted all over the area, signifying hidden caches of supplies. Safe haven. Alright. Just definitely trust no one in the dark. <gasps> Thermos! Alright, so we got this one. Let me mark that thermos off. Alrighty. Let's continue looking around. I know we have some some more stuff to look at. Here we go. So here's the, another sign. No! Right there. Miss Weaver, Cynthia, I'm a friend. Prove it! Uh, you knew Zane, Thomas Zane. You're the Lady of the Light in the song. You can help me. About time. Young man, I've been waiting a very if long If that made me miss the sign, I'm gonna be so mad. No! Pause. Pause. Signs found. 19. That was... Okay. <laughs> it counted it. Oh my god. If... If that had just... Oh my god. I would have freaked out, dude. No. Okay. Everything else is good. <sighs> oh. You almost got me. Oh my god. I was about to be so pissed. Oh my god. Oh, that scared me. It's in the well -lit room. Excuse me? What you need to drive the darkness back. The well lit room is at the dam. I built the room to keep it safe. What? Will it help me find Alice? Will it get me back to the okay. cabin? Fine, let's go. I can get my friends to come back with the helicopter. Oh, we won't go outside. Never. Ooh, what's this? Heavy duty lantern, hell yeah. Rules, young man, and where has that gotten us? Hmm? Whoa, darkness waits in my dreams. I miss you, Tom. Oh wait, no, she was the one Tom was. Oh no. Something was damaged at the transformer yard. <gasps> Ooh. Okay. So we got we got that one. Young man, you're the one who likes to break the rules. I can't be outside in the dark. The kill switch is outside. Okay. So we got this one. Oh, we do get to go out again. Okay. 
Okay, that makes me happy. Alright. Hurry! The switch is on the wall facing the shore. Okay. Dude, I would have been so scared. I was gonna be so sad if I wasn't able to get this again. Warning, this de decommissioned site is private property. The power plant is no longer in operation. Trespassers will be prosecuted. Alright. Is it over here? Yes. Alrighty, well, let us explore. Oh! Oh, what a dick move. Oh. Well, shit. Oh, no. There's more. I'm just trying to see what's... Can you not? Make sure he caught the power of the transformer yard. I was willing to do grunt work for her to get her to help me. I hoped Weaver was dependable. I need to check I'd something. stumbled into this crazy world a little over a week ago. She had been living this insanity for decades. Uh, there's, I, don't, I guess there's nothing near the kill switch that we actually need, or at least nothing I can see or that pops up. Interesting. Rule one, never go out at night. That's a good rule. Safe haven. Oh, another light. I could see the kill switch that would cut the power to the transformer yard. Now I had to find a way to reach it. All right, here's the another sign. Floodgate controls be operated by authorized personnel only. Now we only have one more sign. We're down to a lot of one more. If I could figure out the gates, I could use them to get to Moment the kill three, Always remember the lantern. Okay, let's see. One. Is that what we want activated? No, we want them all activated, I'm guessing. That opens that one. That opens two. Oh, that opens that one. Those ones. What about if I do this? No, okay, that closes it. If I do it again? Opens it. Okay. If I do this. Opens that one. If I do this. Okay, there's no point in clicking that. What if I did this one again? We got the middle ones. This one. This one. And this. No! What this? Yes, did I do it? Yeah! Hell yeah, that should be it. Okay, I think I did it, guys. I think we did it. Well, number two, keep the lights on. Alright, we got a can pyramid here. So we got that. Let me mark that off. That is our last can pyramid for this episode. So we've done that one. And I believe... Yeah, nothing else. Let's cut the power. Gatekeeper, cut the power to the transformer yard. <gasps> I did not think that was going to happen. Oh, yes. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. The I got this. Oh god. 
go, 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 Alan, go, Alan. Oh, 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 oh my god. Okay, we gotta go. We gotta go. Weaver. I'm just gonna do this. Please let me in. Please let me in. <laughs> Open that door. Okay. Weaver. Oof, thank God. Oh my God, my eyes. Hi. Hi. How are you doing? This way, young man. Follow me. It's empty now. We're ready to go. Hold on. This way. We need to go. Okay, okay. I knew them both, Tom and Barbara. I had such a crush on him. <laughs> such a beautiful <laughs> man. I was jealous. There was a part of me that was maybe a little glad when she had the accident. Oh, no. And then Tom started writing and, and woke the darkness up. He tried to bring her back, but you can't do that. There are no free rides like that. I'm starting to realize that. In that case, young man, perhaps you're a smarter man than Tom was. Which looked like her, but it wasn't. Mm. Barbara was sweet. He didn't understand until it was too late. He tried to undo it, wrote himself, her, everything he'd ever Damn. written out of the world. Imagine writing oh. yourself out of he the world. He was so famous. Oh my god. And afterward, no one knew. Oh, Tom. He left only one thing behind in my head. In case it happened again. Insurance. He trusted me. Or perhaps used me a little. Oh. I curse you, Thomas. Damn. Damn. It's been waiting for you. We are characters trapped in a story. And none of us will survive to see the end of it if the darkness isn't stopped. She'll twist the story to her own dark ends. How do you know all this? Tom. That's the way he wrote it. He still talks to me, you know, in television from beyond. From below. Oh my god, how long is this going to take to open? <laughs> he saved us both with light. The darkness stays with you. You sustain. Oh, thank god. I was like, please, how long is this, this going to take? This will take us directly to the well-lit room. Okay, I need to call my friends, tell them where we're going. Hello? Ow! Barry, we're headed to the dam in one of the pipes. Meet us there. Okay, I'll tell Sarah. It's Sarah now? Whoa! No! For the sweet love of... Whoa. Barry! <gasps> no! We gotta go see if they're okay. They're probably dead. <gasps> you must reach the well-lit room. This is no time to be a selfish idiot. That's my best friend. Girl. Well, be a fool. I'll use the pipe. I'll meet you at the dam if you make it. Oh my god. No! Hold on. I at least I, I didn't to have to sure. worry about her. She knew how to stay safe. Okay. Oh! Manuscript. There we go. The well wit. <laughs> The well-lit room. Okay, so we got that manuscript. 
Let me mark that off. Alright, um... Huh. Alright. Is it back here, maybe? It's mentioning there's something here. I don't know what. Yeah, we can't go back up there, I don't think. Well, I guess let's keep going. I don't think I missed anything. At least, I don't think we have missed anything. Oh no. Birds. I hate birds, dude. Like, I love birds, but I hate them in this game. Okay. Checkpoint reached. This will be fun. Oh, I hate that sound. Okay. Ow. Oh. Right, we got them. Keep going up. Barry, Sheriff Breaker, Sarah. The crash site looked bad. But as far as I could tell, the wreck was empty. That's good. That means they're not dead in there. But I don't know what else that means. That's uh, still not good news. The well lit room. All right, let's keep let's keep heading over there, I guess. <gasps> hey! Barry! Barry! Oh. Did not mean to use the, my flare gun. Ah! Different ending in mind. All right, let's head up here. I knew you'd be alright. <laughs> the flaming eye of Mordor. All right, here's another chest. Weaver will meet us at the dam. Okay. Let me mark this off real quick, though. That is our last chest. We just have us one sign left, one manuscript, and three three thermoses, which I don't like the sound of three thermoses. It doesn't it doesn't bring me hope. It makes me feel like we've missed one. But I will not doubt myself yet. Who knows? There could still be time. We could still find something. You know? However, if I do get to a certain point and I haven't found this one I'm looking for, uh, then I'm looking it up. And if we missed it, I'm going to cry. You see those lights? That's the elevator we need to take. Oh no. 
let us live. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What is that sound? Oh, he's dead. Ah! Guys, that should be it. Right, I'm just gonna make sure there's nothing over here. Dude, I have a bad feeling about my thermos. Sorry. <laughs> the Taken are filled with darkness. <gasps> there you are. Oh, my baby. This is the one I was looking for. I was so nervous we were gonna miss this one. All right, let's see. We got that one. All right, so let's keep going. We're nearing the, we're nearing the final, final stretch of this episode. Oh shit. Not you throwing at Barry. Why do I never have this gun reloaded? There we go. Okay, anything over here? Just making sure. Oh no. You know what? We have a, we have a flare gun for this reason. this now. It's almost here. Ow. Shit, all right, yeah, let's just get going. Ow, hit the button. Oh. Sorry, I didn't know I had to hit the button. I didn't know I had to hit the button, guys. Okay. We're almost there. There's an entrance into the dam at the top. What's the plan, Wake? Girl, I don't the know. She's crazy, but she's got something Zane left behind. Something to fix this. Gee, would you be a little more vague? Thomas Zane? Seriously? Might as well be Paul Bunyan or Bigfoot. Yeah, well, he was real. Okay. Should be at the top here, you know? Alright. Ooh, hold on. I got something. I got a thermos. Guys, we could have just walked up the steps. But, you know what? That's you guys. I'm, I'm really not gonna... <laughs> I'm really not gonna fight you on that. Alright, um... They said there should be a sign up here. I'm guessing is it this notice? Okay, wait. There's a button over there that opens the door. Notice this facility has been decommissioned and it's not staffed. Entry into the dam structure without authorization is a criminal offense and may be prosecuted under local and federal statutes, I believe. That's what that said. I think something's broken. Hold the button down so we can okay. get it. Hold on. So I'm marking that off off as our signs. Just to make sure, because I want to make sure we should have yep. 21 signs. All right. So we got all the signs, so no more looking at this page. We have one more manuscript and one more uh, thermos. And then we're done. Actually, yeah, no. And then we're done. We are done. All right. Oh, holding it, guys. Sorry. Get in safely, please. Shit. 
You guys go ahead and find Weaver. She should be in the dam now. I'll have to make it alone through the top. Okay, wait. Good luck. Oh no. Yep. Oh god. You gotta be kidding me. Ah! Ow. Hold on. Got one more evil spool here. Woo! Okay. Down, boy. <laughs> Down, boy. Alright. Here's our last manuscript. And we got. One more. Hold on. Let me let me flip the page real quick. Even though it doesn't matter, I know exactly where it is because <laughs> I wrote it down. Uh, we got one more, and that is our thermos. Thermos is the last one. The last one we need. Okay. So we got that. Oh shit. Oh no. Oh god, not birds. Oh, birds. Okay, got him. Ow. Did not mean to use that. Should be good here. Fishing can be a hobby or a job. Ooh, I'd love to do fishing as a job. Use it then. Oh god, oh god. Still that guy back there, but he's not affected by the thing. Alright. Okay, so he's finally moving. Thank you. Ah, you finally moved too. Oh shit. Alan, you good? You will go no further. Oh, we're fucked. Oh, oh, we're fucked, dude. Stop, stop now. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, fuck, dude. Alright, we got this. Got this. Ow, my head. She hates my ass. Oh, oh god, oh god, oh god. Okay. Alright, this should be where the last thermos is. On the shelf. Yes. Grab it. Grab it, Alan. Okay, we gotta get going. Oh my god. What do I do? No! Alan, what do I do? Oh! Um. What do I do on that moment? We gotta grab the thermos again, because we died. But, okay. What do I do? Alright, I'm gonna let Alan recuperate a little bit, but we gotta get going, buddy. As much as I love you, we gotta get going. Alright. Yeah. 
the thermos, please. Shit. What am I supposed to do there? Like, I'm really trying to understand. So all of this is, like, timed. It's meant to happen. Don't tell me we have to head back up. We can make that jump. Alright, grab the thermos again, Alan. Nice. Great job. Alright. No! I feel like this is going to be the roughest part for me. Just, I don't, I don't know. I don't know why I'm having such a hard time with it. I think it's not that hard, but apparently it's really hard for me. Probably because I'm playing mouse and keyboard. Alright, got it. Okay. Yep, that car's always gonna fall. So, let's, uh. Oh my god, we made it. Okay. We made it and we got the thermos. And it is on our ass. I'm running! And I can mark that thermos got. Oh my god. We're done. We have every collectible for this episode on normal it. mode. Well done. Oh my god. A foolish chance to take. Don't worry about the noise. We're safe here. I have looked after the well lit room for many, many years now. There's no shadow in the well lit room. We're gonna get down there and Our it's gonna be dark. They'll say that the Gulf of Orbs are numbered and changed regularly based on their make and model. Right. <laughs> I love Barry. D dude, Barry, I, I love that outfit. I'm just gonna tell you right now. Beautiful outfit. here back then. They must have built this. Yes, they did. It's my place now. You know what? Fair enough. It's your place now. Alright, let's, let's enter the room. Oh my god. We're getting so close to the end of this. I don't need to worry about the room anymore because 6 and 33 and 118 need changing soon and I don't want to climb up the ladder to change them because it's very late and I'm tired and if you take it I won't have to do that anymore. What is it? The page was autobiographical, a memory from my childhood. But I didn't write this. It was a page written by Thomas Zane. None of them were supposed to exist anymore. Alan, mm -hmm. seven years old, would fight sleep to the bitter end. What? Wait, wait, wait. Sleep, Are you telling me Thomas Zane screaming made Alan? In his mind. One evening, his mother, sitting by his bed, offered him an old light switch. She called it the clicker, and flicking the switch would turn on a magical light that would drive the beast away. To imbue the telescope with all possible power, she added that it had been given to her by Alan's father. Alan never knew him, and anything of his took on mythical proportions in his mind. With the clicker firmly in his hand, Alan finds <gasps> Oh my god! Him. Now, almost 30 years later, Alan thought of this. As he stood on the rim of Cauldron Lake, the clicker in his hand, he took a deep breath and jumped. My mind swirled. I'd given the clicker to Alice, yet it was here. Zane had written it into existence in a story I had written. What? I can get to her now. I can finish this. This is totally copyrighted. But what? Previously on Alan Wake, I wrote a horror story that has come true. Thomas the Lady of the Light discovered the secret she guards. No if I continue like the Dark Presence wants me to, the story I'm writing won't save Alice. <laughs> it's a horror story. No one will survive. You know Zane, Thomas Zane, you're the Lady of the Light in the song. He left something behind to help me. 
the clicker. Alan thought of this as he stood on the rim of cold That's lake. That's wild, dude. His hand. He took a deep breath and jumped. I might I finish this tonight, out. actually. I can finish this. I want to know how this ends. Oh my god. New York City two years ago. Good lord, Alan. You okay? You better not have woken up like that. And do not tell me you took a nap in jeans, of all things. Well, sleeping in jeans just sounds awful. I had a hangover. My head was about to explode and the light hurt my eyes. I needed my sunglasses and painkillers to dull the pain. In okay. We're going to stop there. Um, as always, you guys know, uh, if you do not want to hear what the manuscripts from episode five are uh this is where i leave you so i hope you guys enjoyed this one and as always please like and subscribe it helps a lot and i will see you guys next time for part six now if you want to see what the manuscripts say uh stick around we're about to read them so yeah we'll not read them but he's gonna read them to us uh but yeah all right let's get started manuscript episode five there was yeah there's three nightmare ones and we got everything else Nightingale tried to make sense of the manuscript. It was disjointed and strange. He didn't understand half of it, but it all rang true. Impossibly true. He took out his hip flask when he reached the page that described how he reached the page that made him take out his hip flask. <laughs> it wasn't the booze that made his mind real. <laughs> Sorry. He took out his hip flask when he reached the page that described how he reached the page that made him take out his hip flask. <laughs> what the fuck? Nightingale felt the situation veering out of his control. But the gun at least felt steady in his hands. He was ready to fire, resolved that he would let this happen over his dead body. And yet he hesitated. He had seen this moment before, read it in the page. He was transfixed by the deja vu and the horror that he was a character in a story someone had written. Then the monstrous presence burst in behind him and dragged him into the night. The darkness that wore Barbara Jagger's face was furious. The story in the manuscript had been making it stronger all the time, but now the light had set the writer free and hurt it, weakened it. It was only a matter of days before the dark presence would be strong again, but meanwhile, it would be difficult to recapture the writer. Cynthia Weaver worked hard, following her obsessive rituals, sometimes fighting them, always giving into them in the end. She haunted the halls of Bright Falls abandoned power plant. She marked her caches with light-sensitive paint that could only be seen by eyes that had been touched by darkness and saved by light like she'd been. She was preparing defenses and supply lines for the war she knew would come. The war between the forces of light and darkness. Damn. For it to be free, the dark presence needed the writer to finish the story. Again and again, the story let it get frustratingly close to the writer without letting it capture him. It was bound by the events depicted in the manuscript but it could pursue the writer indirectly, put others on the task and stop those who would help him. It took over everything in its path, made them its puppets, and sent them after Alan Wake. Alice had screamed until she had no voice left to scream. Around her, the darkness was alive. It was cold and wet and malevolent and without end. She was a prisoner, trapped in the dark place. The terror would have burned her mind out, but one thing made her hang on. She could sense Alan in the dark. She could hear him. She could see the words he was writing as flickering shadows. He sensed her too. He was trying to work his way to her. Barry was in his element, making calls, making things happen, even if he didn't entirely know what those things were. He wouldn't let the hot sheriff <laughs> shake down. Even if every noise he heard from outside, and he heard plenty, made him jump. He had only paused to text Al a message, told him to hurry up. Suddenly, Barry froze in mid-dial. A window broke somewhere in the building, and then the lights went out. Barry got back to his feet inside the Bright Falls General Store and dusted himself off. Right next to the cans of baked beans was a locked case filled with flare guns, and yet here was a conveniently placed barrel of crowbars. Barry's smile widened as he realized <laughs> that this was the classic movie scene where the hero had to gear up and arm himself to the teeth. Barry threw himself into the role. The story I had written in the cabin had come true. Touched by the dark presence, I had written a horror story, but the end was still missing. 
The story was incomplete, and the last unfinished page of the manuscript still sat in the typewriter in the cabin study. If I could get back there, if I could read the page, then I could write my own ending to this story and save Alice. Sarah was almost starting to relax. Maybe they could turn this into a win yet. Suddenly, there was a piercing sound, like a table saw gone wild. As a hundred birds made out of shadows swarmed into the rotor, the chopper bucked wildly and the board lit up, telling her what she already knew. They were going down. Barry Wheeler screamed next to her. Thomas Zing knew he had to remove all that had made this horror possible, including himself. That was the only way to banish the dark presence he had unleashed and now looked at him through the eyes of his dead love. But he also knew that despite his best efforts, it might someday return. So even as he wrote himself and his work out of existence, he added a loophole as insurance, an exception to the rule. Anything of his stored in a shoebox would remain. Hmm. Making her way through the water pipe alone, Cynthia was angry at the writer. Foolish young man, taking unnecessary risks. And the way he broke the rules, didn't he understand what was at stake? Since the terrible days in the 70s, she hadn't wavered once, as hard as it had been. She was tired of protecting the town all these long years, and now only wanted to rest. And that's it. Damn, dude. I feel bad for, uh, for Weaver. That just seems tiring. Um... Alan? Well, I think Alan just died. Uh, <laughs> well, we were ending anyways, and it should have saved for uh, episode six. But anyways, I'm going to, I'm going to get big again. Hold on. Ready? Whee! All right. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, I will see you guys for part six, which Looking at the time, uh, I honestly might just finish tonight and upload at a later date, but yeah, I will see you guys in episode six, whenever that comes out, and I hope you guys have a good night or morning whenever you're watching this, and please remember to like and subscribe, it helps a lot, and alright, yeah, <laughs> goodbye!